No. That's the kind of shit that's been happening a lot recently. I just thought he was tilted, man. Damn. Almost folded. <laughs> How we doing? It's been a while. Today I'm not going to be playing too many tables, so I can actually. Oh shit. Oh wait, yeah. Microphone is working. Ha. <laughs> Well, I was going to call this, like, I, I think this is actually kind of a poor bet, like, three bet size, no matter what you have um, when you're covered in a bounty. It's not, like, a huge deal, I guess, but you should size up when you're covered in a bounty. Yo, how does this guy have so many chips? I actually think my best play is going to be all in. I mean, he's going to be opening quite a bit with that stack. Yeah. Good start. I was like, I spoke too soon. That was a, a bit of a gamble on, on their end. But I get it. They're feeling it. They got 300 big blinds. They're like, <laughs> this dude has a 9% fold to three bet. So we're going to make it kind of big, like 4.5, maybe five, actually 4.5 is good. Damn it. <laughs> okay. I found out the amount that'll make them fold. So this tournament right here is a $2,600 buy-in two day event. Up here, we've got a 600, uh, six max. Let's size up just a little bit, just because there's a lot of straight drops. You probably get more action with a, a small bet. People are much better at defending versus small bets. Um, call is the usual. Eh. I'm, I'm a little concerned, but I don't see myself folding. I could probably, oh wow. I was gonna check raise down here. If we get raised, we have to call. Um, I suppose villain just like has has an eight a fair bit. I'm surprised they didn't bet if they do. Maybe a four. Otherwise, I have I have them beat. I don't really see the like a whole lot of. I want them to have hearts, so I have hearts. So that's not good. Not a good bluffing hand. Oh, that call wasn't very good though. I don't I don't know. Maybe it's okay. Oh wow. I think we have to raise. We don't have to, but 3x or so. They shove, we call. It just is. We're not in bad shape versus anything, really. Yeah. I've been using a 2.2 sizing, so I'll just keep doing that. I like when this it happens in this order, when you've been raising a fair bit, and then you get a good hand. I hate when you've been raising a bit, and then you get like the bottom of your opening range a bunch. This four bet could be too large. I'm not sure. Aces versus Kings. Ooh. Almost to a milli stack over here. That's exciting. Uh, gonna call. This is like in a regular spot, kind of a loose call. Please don't shove. We'll call a, a raise though. Uh oh. <laughs> Damn, does that four make me have to call? I don't want to. I really don't want to. But like bounties, right? Sigh. I wouldn't usually make that call, but honestly, if, if I didn't hit the four, I would have folded. Okay, they just have an ace, huh? Or did they have a flush draw, you think? It was a quick call. This was out of line, but sometimes you gotta get out of line. He just has an ace. Nice hand. Oh, fuck. The thing is, he doesn't, he doesn't have any aces worth raising there. That's why I did that, but maybe I should have, yeah. Sigh. Maybe I could have bet River. Shit, bet River. I should have realized that he just doesn't have an ace. I thought that he might be the kind of player who like raises to find out where they are with a weak ace, which is not good, but that's why I chose not to bluff. Although that run out, let's say the spade didn't hit, I definitely would have bluffed. I just didn't really have many blockers. Uh-oh, we got the sucker end. We got the sucker end. No! Damn it. <laughs> that sucks. Um, Pretty good chance that the river's gonna be a chop. I think I have to call for annoying though fuck that i don't think they were folding if i bet turn though i was just like gonna mix there you bet sometimes check sometimes this dude we will get it in versus yeah because he don't care long hair don't care gotta do the fire
Come on. Man. That's disappointing. Would have liked to do well in that one. I think you get to bet here. Relatively small. I'm actually going to keep trying to bet small and see if that works. Um, if he calls again, you can, I do run into a few better pairs, though, which is a problem. Let's go me. Value town. You know, I've been I've been making these general assumptions about this guy based on nothing, based on like a hundred hand sample. I actually don't really know how they play. We have a goddamn stream. Yes, we do. You know, I'm just going to I'm going to make this simple and just bet, bet, bet. Yuck, I hate calling third in, but we do have the button. We got ace, ten of clubs. Also, if Rough Rider shoves, yeah, I'll call. Hmm, quick call. We'll do half pot. Let's go, us. Okay. Let's go. Uh oh. Uh, final three tables. Do I call a shove with King Jack? I think from 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 Vietcom. Too many King X that I dominate. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah. Running hot. Oh wow. Yeah, I mean I call. No. That's the kind of shit that's been happening a lot recently. That fucking sucked. Man, they're running hot. <laughs> that would have been like 100% final table stack. Still in it though. Can't can't let that shit bother us. Now I'm hot as shit. Kind of interested in what social slug has here. Uh, do I keep betting? They had a pair preflop. Are they shoving or or three betting? Maybe not low pairs. I think I'm going to check back and then bluff catch rivers or bet rivers if checked to. Usually about two thirds of pot makes sense. I might go a little bigger. Ooh. <laughs> I put them. I, I thought that they had a lot of low pairs in that spot, which is why I was kind of nervous. If the big blind had 30 bigs, they'd probably shove more often. But with the big blind uh, covering them, they can't. My hand is 888 ace king, so kicker doesn't matter really. The old tilting tiny bet could even go smaller. Fuck that. Oh, whew. I was like, man, if you got a freaking ace, I'm gonna cry. You got middle pair, backdoor flush draw. Uh oh. Now we got two pair. And I think when you have two pairs, it's not top. You want to maybe check raise turn because you unblock their top pairs. But I have a diamond. Maybe I can nah. Maybe I can I could have check called actually. Unlucky for them. I don't see I don't see myself folding ace queen there versus me. I have turn check raise bluff raises. Maybe not that much on that card though. I don't think we're going to play that big of a pot, right? Like, I got to be able to three bet this hand. I was thinking about just flatting because, like, you actually can with, like, jacks and queens. It's sick as if he shoves, actually, like, like I'm crazy. I'll call. No, he just did this, which is, like, hopefully he's putting money out there for me to just take. He's got, like, a 46% raise first spin. Let's go. Yeah. This little this build up here, Milly stack. We're just calling. It's an interesting flop, one that we're gonna call at least one bet on usually, unless that bet is all in. Or even an over bet, I might I might fold. But not this bet. Fours, sixes, basically under cards to the nine or the cards I was hoping for. I could all, I would also do this to induce. So
it's really tough to believe this. Like, would, would a nine do this? W or wouldn't a nine just be happy calling off? Or would an overpair check back turn? Hmm. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> Shit. I just thought he was tilted, man. Damn. I almost folded. You know what? I should have listened to myself because I was like, I'm going to bet full because I would I would do this to induce too. But then I was like, man, it just doesn't make sense. Like he seems like pissed that I've been. Hmm. That was dumb. That was dumb. OK, I check nine, seven. Well, it wasn't a nine. No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. Son of a bitch. That was some station stuff. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. I'm I'd say I'm mo I'm pretty good at being right, though, too. Uh, so far, we're guaranteed $1,700. I'm going to call one, I guess. I almost don't want to call this, but yeah, fool. Actually, something that I tell myself sometimes when I've been making too many calls and, I, and wrong calls or is like, um, I don't think I'm well like known for making big faults. <laughs> so like people aren't really trying to bluff me that much. Yeah, I think think long, think wrong. Think long, think wrong applies most to when your instinct is full and you talk yourself into a call, says Matt Tex. Yes, it's hard to make a hand, but they always have it. I don't think they do always have it. Some people really don't bluff that much, though. Not this guy. This, this social slug is is uh, a creative player, especially preflop. Hmm. I think monotone boards are supposed to check a bit more. Hmm. Almost, if I had nothing, I would raise this bet. I have showdown value. Do I actually want to turn my hand into a bluff? Yeah, I think I have enough showdown value. I want to check. Yeah. Hmm. He wouldn't. He wouldn't have folded. I don't think. Right. Have you ever went broke from poker? Yes. Had to get back a number of times, and just recently I punted off a decent amount of money playing, like, games that I should not have been playing. I mean, I got back doors. Feels like I'm losing momentum though. Like, like. Let's go. Why don't I shave? Cause I fucking like my beard and shaving is a pain in the ass. Now, right now I'm like two weeks into this challenge and I'm looking a little bit caveman like, um, but usually I'm a little bit more groomed than this. I raised like, you know, closer to three X, I guess with the hundred bigs. And I just kind of step it down, down to min raise below 30. And whatever stack you have, isn't that important. It's more whoever the short stacks are. Do I have value bet queen high? Probably just let him, I should have let him bluff. Yeah. I've raised like three buttons in a row. Which makes me think that I'll get played back at somewhat soon, but. We're coming back. I just gotta make it a little tougher for myself. I may, I was thinking about sizing up just because he calls so much, or they call, don't know who they are. I'm going to wait for the other table because if they if they call, there might be a ladder. Man, fuck. Damn. That sucks. Tens were real good for you today. Nice hand, buddy. It was all my fault, too. <sighs> oh, well. Anyway, I appreciate y'all. If I have any hands to really go through, I mean, I guess. Let's see. Damn, you pretty much always fold like a pair in this spot, like sixes, which is comparable, except sixes blocks it straight. It folds. Damn. I mean, it's, it's not it's not exactly the same thing, but I thought that we'd actually call a bit more. Interesting though. It likes to check race fives, but like, I don't know. Yeah, um, made a, made a mistake there. I thought based on the game flow that there was that they were kind of likely to want to punt. And I really uh, 
should have just stuck with the plan, you know, which was to bet full. Anyway, I'm out of here. Uh, not the best end of the night, but I'll be back soon.